puppy is having fun. Not quite sure what he's chasing, but I've been in here this morning fencing off or um, moving the electric fence. You can see where the horses were grazing is on this side, and this is the long grass here. And um, you can see the difference here. So their manure is here. There's Inca in the grazed bit, and then this is the long grass. So the fence has been put up all the way along and the dogs are all enjoying it. And then I look up, this field is supposed to be full of sheep with a ram. And there is no sign of them anywhere. Not a sheep to be seen. And it's a lovely sunny day. So I'm like, uh-oh, where have they gone? There's none anywhere. So they're either in that pocket of woodland over there or they're up near the water tank over there. So I'm gonna have to go and check. This is Leon's flock, the new ram. So off I'm going to do a field walk now to find where the flock is. The grass is loads of grass. You can see how it's up to her hawks for autumn graze. So, and it's a be another beautiful sunny day. And you can see the leaves are almost all off. The horse chestnuts have their winter silhouettes, which are always so beautiful. The oak still has a lot of her leaves on. The ash, all those ash in there, their leaves are all gone. And the beech tree still has her leaves. So does the willows. Okay, I'm gonna go hunt for sheep now. Ah, oh. well, there is two. Oh, thank goodness. You're all in here. I was wondering where you were, ladies. Well, you're some of you. Where's the rest of you? This is beautiful Kestrel. Yeah, this is gonna be your first year lambing. Oh, look, more. Thank goodness. I was wondering where you all were. Yeah. Uh, there you are. Good girl. Uh, That's a job I've got to do. Clean up that old electric fence around this willow. Because um, I had the electric fence there for years to protect the willow while it was growing. But now it's at the stage where it doesn't have a tender trunk, so it won't be eaten. Oh look, you're a bit tangled. Yeah, another reason why I've got to uh, get rid of this electric fence. Look at you guys. You're so beautiful in the silhouette, aren't you? Beautiful sheep in a silhouette. That is so gorgeous. I always like winter silhouettes of sheep and trees and all kinds of things. Okay, you guys are all well. Thank goodness for that. Beautiful Kestrel. So they're all lovely. Now let's see if I can find Leon. Where's Leon? Up oh, there he is. How are you doing, Leon? Are you doing your job? What a beautiful day. Absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful morning. And thank goodness all the sheep are safe and sound. Now you're not to bark at them. Java, 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 behave, good boy. Yes, good boy. Your mama knows it's not herding time. You've got to learn when herding time is and when, ah, 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 Java, good boy. Good boy, that's it. Let the sheep go. Ah, 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 nope, good boy. Okay. 
Well, now I can turn the horses out because I know. Hello, everybody. Java, Java, good boy. Leave it alone. Good boy. Yeah. You know, you've got to educate your son that when we walk through the fields, it's not the time to chase the sheep. Look at these trees. With the sun on them, they're glorious. They're autumn colors. Amazingly, that horse chestnut hasn't left, lost its leaves, but I think partially that's due to it's kind of protected by the prevailing winds and breezes by this little glen. Okay, ladies, see you later. I'm glad you're all safe and sound and in the field and not escaped somewhere. Hey girls. Uh, hey lammies. Uh, uh, what? Uh, Woo! Uh, what? Uh, Don't knock me down. Janie Mac, you came in there fast. Okay, everybody. Moving day. Let's go this way. Come on. We're going over here. I'm being stompled. Okay, hopefully they won't crowd me as I open this gate here. <laughs> you know exactly what's happening, don't you? Oh dear, this is very, um, oh, it's not very tightly knotted. Oh good, okay, this will be easy. Okay, let me, no, no, come on, wait, 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 you little tyke. There we go. Galloping down into the field. With a little java behind. Look at them all. They think they're going to the field across the way, but they're not. <laughs> Ebony's just here. 
didn't go far. Loads of fresh grass in here. Well, they're definitely consuming the grass. Look at the trees all yellowing. Oh, cool, a raven. Okay, you can hear the raven call. It's in that tree. It's a really deep call. 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 We have ravens that nest around here. They're a big bird. There it is up at the top of that tree. There's two of them. One flew away. One is still up there. The very tippy top. They're the biggest, the largest corvid. Corvids are magpies, crows, jackdaws, hooded crows. So that's a pair. That well, that's one left. But they have a very distinctive, deep kind of. So I was probably talking over it when it occurred. That was me making it here. So that's one. Look at him up in the top of that tree. I don't know if you can see, he's right there. They're really big. You can hear them when they're flying by. He's got a very loud wing flight noise. Go on. You gonna fly or call? Anyway, there's there it goes. Look. are now spreading out to eat. <laughs> 